Hi, I'm Matt from Eco Creations. I'm here today to show you how to do some chocolate dipped strawberries. Um, make lovely gifts for Valentine's Day. You can use them to decorate birthday cakes and you can also use them to serve a tea and coffee after a lovely meal. All right, so let's get started. Um, firstly, I've just made us some um, white compound chocolate from the supermarket. Um, I put it in for uh, 20 seconds at a go and it's about 300 grams of chocolate. So you want to melt it and as you're melting it in the microwave, you want to give it a stir after, after 20 seconds and then give it another 20 seconds. I did that three times. So basically three times your chocolate should be melted. You need to use a microwavable um, proof dish, otherwise it will explode in the, uh, in the microwave. So we're doing um, four white dipped chocolate strawberries first, and then we're gonna do dark chocolate strawberries. Um, and then I've also managed to find some red chocolate as well, which I bought from a um, supplier of mine. Um, which is also really different and it's uh, quite good to use as well for Valentine's Day. So just doing these now and as I'm dipping them to get the excess chocolate off I'm just scraping it on the side of the dish as you can see and that just gets rid of any residual chocolate that's sitting there so you don't end up with a massive amount of chocolate underneath the actual strawberry and these will actually sit nice and flat. So I have actually gone ahead and made some already dipped because it does take time to set. If you were in a hurry and you wanted to set these quickly, you can just put them all onto the tray like we're doing now and then put them into a fridge or the freezer and just until they're set. They won't take very long at all. Okay, so while these are setting, I'm just going to push them aside and I'm going to make our foaming bags for decorating later on. So I've just grabbed a, um, a piece of baking paper, just teared it off, just going to fold it in half so it's a triangle. And then down the edge, nicely flattened. Grab the knife, grab it under the piece of paper and just slowly, slowly cut it, and then cut it the opposite way away from you. Now we're going to grab the edges, gonna keep the corner of the paper onto the, well, my right hand side, your left. And then I'm gonna grab the top, pulling it there like that, just gonna Bend it down so you can see. And just slowly twist it towards me. And then put my finger in the inside, thumb on the outside, and I'm just twisting the paper in to the piping bag. And with the top piece on the top, just bending it over, and then just holding it there. And then let it go, and it's done. That's my piping bag. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how to do a tuxedo strawberry. Um, so basically, I'm going to grab the strawberry. I'm going to make sure the consistency though of my dark chocolate is nice and runny. And if it has slightly set, just warm it up again in the microwave for about another 20 seconds. Um, remember to give it a stir and don't let it, don't let it um, stick on the edges. Otherwise, you know when you're stirring it, it will, um, it will burn. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab the strawberry by the green and then I'm going to dip it on an angle. So, do it like so, and again we scrape the bottom of the, of the strawberry, get rid of any excess chocolate. Then we just twist it around the other way, and do exactly the same, just like so, as you can see that. And then again we just scrape that off like so. And put that there like that. So what we've done is we've done the double breast basically of the suit. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to marble a um, chocolate strawberry with red chocolate and some white chocolate. All I've done is melted my red chocolate and I've just swirled a little bit of white chocolate on top. And I'm going to grab my chocolate dipped strawberry and all we're going to do is then just dip it in to the chocolate. And we've got a lovely marble effect. All right, so here's the fun part. We're going to start decorating our chocolate dipped strawberries now. So I'm just going to grab my piping bags and a pair of scissors because we need to cut the ends off the piping bags. So these are my piping bags. Firstly, I'm going to load up my dark chocolate into one of my piping bags. Just make sure that your chocolate is still runny. If it's not runny, just chuck it into the microwave again for about around 20 seconds and give it a good stir. So it should be nice and, and runny like so. So what we're going to do is I'm going to grab my chocolate, grab a spoon, and just 
carefully pour it in to the piping bag, just like so. And remember, don't pour it in too much. You want it to be about three quarters full. Because otherwise, you won't be able to close and seal off your piping bag because it'll be there'll be too much chocolate inside. So as you can see, I've got my piping bag like that with the chocolate. Just fold the end up, fold the corners in, like so, and then just roll the top down onto your piping bag, just like so. Okay. So now I'm just going to move these piping bags. Cut the end off. Now cutting the end off depends on how thick you want your chocolate to be. So just give it a little squeeze. So I'll just give it a little squeeze just to make sure that the chocolate's running nice and smoothly and that the hole's big enough. If the hole's not big enough and if your chocolate's not smooth enough, any lumps that are in your chocolate, they will um, not come through the hole. So what I've got is another piece of baking paper because it's going to be a little bit messy so I don't want to get on the bench. So just grab my strawberry. And what we're going to do is we're going to just drizzle chocolate. So just nicely over the top of the strawberry like so. And now we just lift this up and put that back. So it's got a lovely little decoration. And what I'm going to do next is I will, while I've got my dark chocolate in my piping bag, I'm going to decorate my tuxedo. So. We've got the blazer, we've got the white shirt, so now I'm going to do is the, the buttons, like so. We'll give them three buttons. And we need to leave enough room for us to do the bow tie. Now to do the bow tie, what we need to do is draw a line down, up, down, up. Down, up. And so then you're left with your little penguin suit, your little tuxedo. I've already loaded up my piping bag with the red chocolate, just as we did before with the dark chocolate. So now we're just going to do a nice big red heart on this strawberry. So I'm just going to be rude and turn it towards me for now so I can do the, do the heart. So just piping it gently. Always remember to let the Chocolate, do the work. Okay, the strawberry one with the heart. Okay, so next I'm going to just show you the, uh, we'll do a polka dot strawberry. So I've already put my white chocolate into the piping bag. And so this, what we're going to do is do nice little dots on our strawberry. What I do is I just go in between the ones I've done before. So the strawberry has got dots pretty much everywhere. Okay, and the last one, since we've got a, a white chocolate dipped strawberry with dark chocolate, and while I've got my white chocolate, I'll do the opposite. So again, we're just gonna Lightly drizzle over the thinner the lines, I always think make it more, look more elegant. So there you go, there's six strawberries, chocolate dipped six different ways for you to play with at home. Until next time, have fun and we'll see you again soon. Bye.